Hi, hi folks. Will that dope that's soiling the White House, Joe Biden, he and his administration, they are protecting the United States along the lines from that old movie, The Gang That Could Not Shoot Straight. That's what they're doing. <laughs> it must have been Dopey Joe's favorite movie. Here. He allowed a commie spy balloon from China to traverse all across these here United States of America, gathering up sensitive information from various military bases. Then after it hit the Atlantic and finished its mission, he shoots it out of the sky. Gets criticized for allowing that to happen. So now he becomes gun shy. And there's a balloon he shot over Canada. Gee! Why did he shoot that balloon? Fearing what, it, it, <laughs> fearing what that balloon may contain and or further criticism. But it's come to light now that that balloon most likely belonged to a hobby group in Northern Illinois known as the Battle Cap Balloon Brigade. A $12 balloon filled with helium and they attack. <laughs> They attach a device that monitors back to them its location. So the balloon, that $12 balloon, sailed across the United States into Alaska over one of the islands the current then picks up that sends it over Canada. And that's when they lost contact with that balloon at the same time Joe Biden issued two. $400,000 missiles to knock down that balloon out of the sky. So close to $800,000 Joe spent to knock out a $12 balloon. Now here's my concern. Is he going to reimburse that club, the $12, plus the equipment they had attached to the balloon that sent back its location? No, he's not going to do that. The gang that could not shoot straight. That your Democratic Party soiling the White House in these here United States of America. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America. And God bless the nation you happen to be. See ya. <laughs>